I experienced a quality of my heart that was incredibly compassionate. I looked at form as if I was standing behind the forms of the universe and I looked out at the forms and it was as if I saw the preciousness of all the forms. Then you start to get greedy for the freedom. I mean, if there's one addiction that outlasts all the others, it's the addiction to be free. It's the addiction to come up for air, to live in the light, to live with love, to be spacious, to be present, to be ah. You look around and the suffering stinks and you, you try to do something about it, but it is so immense the amount of suffering that you've got to fill the dike there and it's leaking there and you've got to fill it there and it's leaking there. And where are you going to do it? What are you going to do it? And as a human being, you do what you can to end suffering because of the compassionate nature of your heart. At the same moment, you know that it's perfect, including your wanting to get rid of it. Do what you do as impeccably as you can, but what effect it has is what effect it has. And don't you get lost in being attached to the fruits of the action. And for you to deny the beauty in order to deal with the humiliated, or deny the humiliated in order to deal with the beauty, you're all of those things. You've got to listen to all those messages. You've got to enjoy the joy of the good fortune you have in life.